Praise the Lord, my beloved ones. Today is another prophetic wonder, another prophetic day through our Lord God Jesus Christ. And the Lord says that your godly ordained spouse shall be your divine helper. Hallelujah. My beloved ones, this means a lot for all those who have been waiting upon the Lord to have the godly ordained spouse. And it means a lot for all those who had been waiting upon the Lord to have or receive the divine helpers. My beloved ones, the Lord says that this month, when you are blessed with amazing favors, the Lord says that this is one of the favors that your own spouse, your godly ordained spouse shall be your divine helper. The Lord says that all of a sudden things will be seen upside down. It will happen upside down. All of a sudden, you will find that your godly ordained spouse who was not helping you earlier, all of a sudden, your spouse has started struggling for you, started helping you, started focusing and have become a divine helper for you. The Lord says that your godly ordained spouse shall bring you into focus. The godly ordained spouse shall have the focus to help you. My beloved ones, all of a sudden it will strike, it will come into the mind of your godly ordained spouse that you have to receive the godliness to our Lord God Jesus Christ and that is by helping you. So your spouse will now realize that they shall become godly only after they have become your divine helper. So they will realize in their spirit, the Holy Spirit is going to touch them. Whoever is your spouse, no matter what they have been doing to you in the past, now they shall realize all of a sudden they shall come into picture, they shall come into obedience, they shall be led by the Holy Spirit. And all of a sudden you will find that they have started joining their hands with you in unity. And this is their righteousness, this is their awakening, says the Lord, this is their awareness. So all of a certain they shall come into awareness, all of a certain they shall be awakened and all of a sudden the Holy Spirit will reveal it to them that they have to help you, my beloved ones. Now this is truly the favor that you have, that your godly ordained spouse, your spouse, your husband or your wife, they shall come and act and perform the obedience they will act they will take the action of faith and they will be your divine helpers no matter who they are what they have been doing my beloved ones the lord says that it doesn't matter what has been happening up till now what matters is what is going to happen now because it is now that is the grace of God. It is now that the Lord's plan and purpose is open. It is now that the heaven has been opened for you. It is now that the Holy Spirit is present in your life, in your family. It is now that the manifestation has begun. It is now that you have received the favor. My beloved ones, this is a matter of rejoicing and this month is also the month of rejoicing my beloved ones you shall rejoice when you see all of a sudden your wife has started helping you in your ministry and also supporting you in the homework everything that you are doing in the home and outside your wife will start supporting you all of a sudden earlier she had been denying you Earlier, she had been going against you and you had been praying. You had been fasting and praying. I can see you, my brother, you are on your knees and you are crying out to the Lord. You have been praying so that your wife will turn to the Lord, turn her ways 
away from the demonic mindset to you to the obedience of the Lord and now your godly ordained spouse your wife shall come in the perfect unity and the holy communion with you she shall become submissive she shall become your divine helper she shall obey you she shall obey the Holy Spirit she will hear the voice of the Lord so she shall repent my beloved ones this is for you this favor has come upon you my brother and to all the sisters who have been given and blessed with the ministry the Lord says now your husband will come and promote you will encourage you will push you forward will help you will encourage you my beloved ones this is what every woman wants that her husband should be supportive so shall be with you you shall have a wise man the lord says that your singlehood is over along with this prophecy because it is time for you to have the wisdom the wise man the perfect man the obedient one of the lord you had been praying and waiting zealously the one who comes and supports you and guides you and encourages you to become the servant of god to become the minister of god my beloved ones this is a favor on every woman says the lord so you shall serve the lord more zealously you shall come upwards when you feel that you are drowning you shall get the supportive hand of the divine helper and that divine helper is your own godly ardent spouse the husband that you have been waiting for is coming to help you with the divinity with the heart of the lord hallelujah my beloved ones it is obedience says the lord that has brought these blessings upon you and this is for you because you are receptive you are receiving this you have been waiting for this my beloved ones i receive a lot of emails and most of them are the prayer requests for marriages however i always ask them to wait upon the lord to find the godly ordained spouse who is equally yoked who shall be supportive no matter what the devil shows you but we do not lean on our own understanding so the lord says the man who is coming into your life now is the wise man or the woman who shall be your godly ordained spouse shall be a wise woman she shall be obedient we have proverbs 13 20 that says that the wise men when we have the fellowship with the wise we become wise but when we have fellowship with the fools it has a dead end it is a destroyed relationship so now you had been crying zealously praying zealously you had been fasting zealously you had been waiting upon the lord with patience and it is the time for the favor to come to you you are not going to the favor but the favor is coming to you hallelujah the divine helper shall be sent to you my beloved one so be there where you are says the lord do not wander here do not wander there do not go left do not go right take rest be there where you are the lord is sending you the angel the divine helper the man of god the woman of god the one who shall boost your fellowship the one who shall be encouraging you because now the lord says that you are struggling hard to have the fellowship you are looking for the divine helper but you shall be amazed to know that the divine helper shall be your own godly ordained spouse so the divine helper is not someone else but your own husband or your own wife my beloved ones so 
from today if you are sitting next to your wife you are a pastor and i can see you sitting next to your wife and she is already a godly ordained woman but now she will be more supportive says the lord you are a pastor and you shall do miracles in the name of jesus and with her support the lord says that you shall boost your divine energy levels you shall be strengthened because she shall support you my beloved ones you shall receive more of the strength more of the energy more of the gospel of truth and addition to your wisdom and addition to your prosperity and addition to your blessings because the divine helper is no one else none other than your godly ordained spouse my beloved ones if you have been led by the holy spirit to this prophetic channel then subscribe to it and press the notification bell icon to receive the daily prophetic anointing we thank all those who are honoring the lord with their wealth and for all the offerings we bless you with a hundredfold of return my beloved ones if you have not yet received our lord god jesus christ if you have not yet received the holy spirit we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand our father in heaven we come into your presence to our lord jesus christ and today we receive salvation we receive holy spirit into our heart oh lord forgive us our sins and help us to be born again we shall seek you oh lord jesus christ unto zion in jesus mighty name amen my beloved ones with the small prayer of repentance your sins are forgiven and you have received holy spirit within you you shall walk the walk of righteousness